Volunteers in the Cowichan Valley formed a work crew this morning building a fence to help protect an endangered species of toad. It is the western toad's annual migration. The little tadpoles that were swimming in Wake Lake have grown into frogs and they are starting to cross busy roads to migrate to a nearby woodland area. To prevent the toads from being squished beneath the tires of passing vehicles, the Cowichan Land Trust organized a volunteer crew to build a fence and pitfall traps on River Bottom and Barnum Roads. The work is being overseen by companies hired by the Ministry of Transportation. What we're doing is we're putting in um, fencing using plastic um, and wooden stakes, and then every so often we put in a bucket so the toads come up to the fencing and they can't hop and they don't climb very well so they run into the fencing they kind of walk along and then they fall into the buckets mm -hmm. the little pitfall traps and then we go along and monitor the traps and empty them out and take them across the road safely and let them go on their way western toads are listed as a species of special concern in canada and in british columbia specifically they are considered a threatened species the fences will contain many of the frogs, will contain many of them, but others will find their way around and attempt to cross the road on their own. The best thing, if they can, is just to avoid driving on Barnum and River Bottom for the next two weeks. That would be ideal because that decreases the amount of cars and the likelihood. Mm -hmm. And if they can't and they absolutely have to go this way, maybe just slow down a little bit. I mean, you, if they're on the road, you, you can't miss them. They're so tiny. They, they wouldn't be able to avoid them. But the best thing is just to avoid these two roads for a couple weeks, and that would be ideal. The volunteers expect to have the toad fence complete by the end of today.